That gets me like nothing. Well, I think the you know, best we can hope for is to have our GDP continue to rise. Well, GDP is up. Brain, si brain drain situation's at an end. Ah, crap. Our oil supply's down, though. Well, we're still holding steady in the polls. Well, uncompetitive economic status is going down. Looks like the deficit's going down as well. And, uh... Yeah, okay. Well, I think we might be back on track here. Let's stay the course. GDP's up, unemployment's down. Okay, apparently my welfare minister doesn't like me so much and she wants to leave. Um, so I think we should get rid of her. Are we gonna allow drilling? I'm not a big, like, environmentalist type of guy, and I... I don't understand why people get so up in arms about, like, drilling and pipelines and that type of stuff, so I'm allowing drilling. How are we doing? Okay, our member... our party has way more members than the other party. I mean, I don't know how the racist genocidal party of baby eaters is gaining any support at all. But apparently they are, which is uh, bizarre to me. All right, we have the deficit in one quarter. Check that shit out. So we're back on top. Well, almost. But uh, yeah, and we also have more activists, which is which is good. We have about one and a half million more members than they do. So yeah, GDP keeps rising. We're going to stay the course. I'm going to raise capital gains tax a little bit. to shore up some more income. Credit rating upgraded. All right. Woohoo! We have we we're back in surplus, baby. I don't know how we did it, but all that matters is that we did it. So man, we just, we uh, figured that shit out. I guess our economic taxes were, or luxury taxes were not as a good idea as I thought they were. Wow, we've even managed to bring some of the capitalists under our sphere of influence. We've managed to make them not hate us. I don't know how we managed to do that either, but... Alright, here's a new thing we're going to do. I am going to legalize prostitution. Which will increase our gross domestic product. Middle income people are still not happy with us, which is surprising that we're garnering so much support without them. Oh yeah, we've increased science funding to an extreme degree. Race Discrimination Acts. 
handgun laws. Oh, that's something we don't want to touch right now. Uh, let's spend a bunch of money here. I think this will help. Alright, next turn. Oh, what? Market meltdown? Well, we still have a... I'm in a suit, by the way, which makes me, you know, more amped to play this game. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing things right. Market meltdown. This is... Okay. Well, we may not have done anything wrong, but a crisis of confidence overseas in the mortgage market had led to a global meltdown for the stock market. But we've got a new technological advantage. In our, uh... Which does what? Oh, it increases GDP. Well, we still have a huge, huge surplus. Unfortunately, we gain a lot of debt over that short span of time. Well, the capitalists are down in support for me, mainly because of the thing that's not my fault. It's the global market cr crisis meltdown. Oh yeah, I was going to fire you. And hire someone like you, who has some experience. Well, what can I do? Let's see some policy ideas that we can do. Well, we can implement some rent controls. As well, we can implement some food stamps. Which will hopefully help us in the long run. Alright, let's go to the next turn. Uh oh, a religious plot. Our security services have been watching a group of religious extremists known as Crusaders of the Lord for some time, and recent statements by the leader have, gi leader have given us cause for concern. The organization has become more militant and often advocating violence and direct attacks against enemies of God, your governments, specifically your governments. We believe this represents a material threat to our security, and we should keep a close watching them. I, I there's nothing I can do about them apparently. Well, crime and poverty are down. Why is my credit downgraded? deficit again. Where can we slash some spending then? I don't know how we switched uh, income so fast. So that's not good. That's really not good. I like this whole technological advantage. That certainly helps us. 
All right, we got to figure out a way to make some money. Or stop spending some money. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna. Oh, I don't wanna. Mess with education. God, these are all so important. Alcohol abuse is costing us a lot of money. Intelligence services. Well, we can just cut them. And raise inheritance tax a little bit. And hopefully that'll uh, balance some things out. GDP is up. Failed assassination attempt. Wow! When they arrested a car, a carload of what appeared to be religious fanatics planning to attack you and your cabinet, a van filled with explosives and small arms was stopped by our vigilant police after intelligence. Uh. Intercepted. Uh, sorry. After intelligence intercepted a security personnel and blah 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 blah. The army of God. This is your. Oh, I've never even looked at this. Okay. The Land Army, or no, the, the Battenberg Group and Crusaders of the Lord. Okay. Well, are still holding well. Are still holding up in the polls. Fortunately, we've lost some of our retired voters, but we've replaced them with liberal voters and poor voters. So, uh, yeah. Don't know if we're really winning out there. But our GDP is on the rise once again. Um, is the global economy coming back into balance? Well, no, it's still crashed pretty hard. But we shall weather this storm. I don't know who I was supposed to. I, I was trying to be there. I want to see how popular my policies are. Well, let's see what our changes are. Health is up, education is up, crime is down, environment is up, technology is up, productivity is up, unemployment is up too. Um, unemployment is fluctuating a lot. CO2 emissions are down, air travel is down, immigration also down. Racial tensions, foreign relations up, poor earning is up, middle earnings are up, high earnings are down, GDP is down slightly, it looks like it's up. Private healthcare. What was that? It was international, international trade is up. Oh, private healthcare. Okay, good. We want private healthcare to go down. Tobacco use is down. Alcohol consumption is up. Why is our tourism down? Maybe it's because of the global economy. Hmm. Let's legalize prostitution some more and increase our GDP a bit. I 
Oh, Jesus, these religious bastards. A scientific discovery. All right. For years, we have wondered why those scientists spent so much time underground tunnels mumbling about quirks and mesons. But today, a major scientific discovery was announced concerning new particles, colliders, and other physics mumbo-jumbo. While it's true that teleportation and hyperspace aren't within us, aren't with us just yet, this is still great news for the high-tech industry. A superb payoff for such an educated workforce. Well, we're still managing to weather the economic recession somehow. Our deficit is down. Oh. Alright, uh, sorry about that. Had to go for a second, but we're back. And uh, things are looking good. For us. Oh, it's the Patriots. Let's see what the capitalists are all upset about. There's toll roads? Fuck that shit, man. Cancel toll roads. <laughs> the capitalists were happy about that. What a bunch of assholes. And they're pissed off. They don't like rent controls. Income tax, corporate tax. They don't like anything I'm doing. Well, it's almost time for the election. What? Oh my god. It's fucking... Um, well, let's load... Our autosave. And we get to the election. Here we go. <laughs> well, I guess they couldn't get me that time. Really? Wow, look at... look. Jesus Christ. I thought we had 70-something percent in the polls. But it doesn't matter, because we won overwhelmingly with 52% of the vote. We're the racist genocidal baby eater party. Uh, the racist genocidal party of baby eaters. Couldn't even match Stalin's super happy fun party of overall positive experiences. In fact, more people stayed home than voted for the opposition. Jesus, our activists turned out to uh, give us a 40% boost in the vote and 77% of our people turned out. Let's do the breakdown. Social, how would, why would any socialist vote for the, for, for the racist party of genocidal baby eaters? I don't know. But the poor came out for me big time. Lost with the capitalist big time. One with the retired, one with retired people, one with commuters, one with patriots, motorists, liberals. Of course, we didn't win with the religious contingent. We even won with wealthy voters. One with the, one with the trained unionists, slightly lost with the self-employed. Environmentalists, wealthy we won with, poor we won with, middle income we won with, parents we won with, farmers, state employees. We almost won with conservatives, too. It was... What a brutal, brutal election. I've managed to not only win the election, but take the majority of the vote. The entire election electorate is with you, leaving no doubt that you are this country's legitimate leader. Internet tracking. Ban internet tracking. I thought toll roads would increase. Maybe we should, uh, oh, we got a small surplus again. How's the GDP doing? It's virtually unchanged. Well, let's go to our. Wow. This person really doesn't like me. Um, let's see our changes. Health, education, 
Crime is down, poverty is down, quality's up, the environment's up. Unemployment is up, unfortunately. GDP is down slightly. Well, poor and middle earnings are up. High earnings are down as usual. Are we still in an epic global recession? How do I get to... Wow, income tax is a huge proportion of our... Yeah, we're still in an economic recession and we have a surplus. How are we not the best economic stewards in the world? We don't even need to do anything. We can just hold the fort. We, the government can shut down and go home because they've done such a good job. Oh. Okay, well, we got to figure this shit out so we don't keep getting assassinated. All right, internet crime. Situation has developed. We're seeing a sharp race raid increase in internet crime okay our credit has been upgraded to now a well after our election our poll numbers are slightly falling Hmm, so that's not good. I think we're going to have to increase intelligence services. Why would I even do that? It doesn't look like it does anything. Looks like it's better just to keep it on the lowdown. Oh, well, let's give a sizable spy agency. But that's going to piss some people off. So, what can we do? Uh, I'm going to. Eliminate racial school, faith-based school subsidies. And also get rid of prayer in schools. I Actually, I'm going to cancel that. Entirely when I can. I'm going to wait till the next turn. Why is the GDP down? Crimes up, unemployment's up. Still have a good surplus. Okay, we need to increase our security effectiveness. Cancel prayer in schools. State schools. We're going to increase to ten billion a quarter. Oh, I don't have enough local capital to do that. Next turn. Filibustering. Wow. Why is my credit rated downgrading again?
Okay. Well, we're bouncing around 65%, which is still good. Our surplus is slightly down. Oh, the global economy is in recovery now. Crap, what was the thing I wanted to do? Oh, I wanted to increase school spending. Increase education. Alright, well that is probably going to bring us into death. Jesus Christ. Well, never mind, our GDP is up. Unemployment's down. Well, we're going to send troops to defend our oil supplies. Well, we've managed to get our security effectiveness up to poor. Oh, I think it's because uh, the economy is in full and is in recovery mode. So we're able to keep our surplus high. Wages. How is... That's not wages. I'm looking at productivity. Where's GDP? There it is. Yeah, GDP is on the rise. Mm hmm. Why can't I find productivity in there? What is unemployment? Why is there no numbers here? That pisses me off. There's productivity. Oh, productivity is always up. And we're. we're, we're edging ever closer to becoming a competitive economy. Okay, well... Surplus is continuing to grow. Anyway, I think we're going to have to uh, end this let's play for now because I do have to uh, depart. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. This has been Joseph who's run out selling. Signing off for now and until next time. Well, actually, before I leave, let's take a quick... Look around, see how we're doing. Our cabinet is very effective. They've been in office for a while now. I haven't really changed them up much. We're paying down our debt. Our surplus is good. Our income is growing. Our expenditures are not. But uh, religious people really hate me. Capitalist people really hate me.
Where are the religious percentage of the... Well, apparently the religious population is only 3%. Wow, a wealthy population is really high. I don't know how I managed to win without any support from them. The middle income, the middle class. I guess I'm able to make up for it in a lot of ways. Conservatives. Maybe it's because we have a naturally high population of socialists. Anyway. So, but yeah, we're doing good. Global economy's on the rise. Our GDP has remained stable. We're in surplus now, paying down our debt. We're in a pretty good equilibrium, except for the fact we keep getting assassinated, which we should probably deal with at some point. So we'll try and figure that out next time. But until next time, I would like to thank you guys for watching. This has been Joseph Ishmael Rosalyn. Signing out for now, and until next time, you guys, take care.